Have you ever wondered, what am I really good at? This question, simple yet profound, is the catalyst that sparks the journey of self-discovery and personal growth. Recognizing our talents, our strengths, and our passions is an integral part of understanding who we are. This video is here to guide you, to help you unearth those hidden talents that lie within. Because after all, understanding your talents is the first step towards a more fulfilled life. Consider, for instance, the story of Tim, a 30-year-old accountant. Tim lived a life dictated by numbers and spreadsheets, spending his days ensnared in the web of fiscal responsibilities. He was good at his job, no doubt, but there was a subtle void that seemed to echo within him, a yearning for something more than the monotony of digits. One day, on a whim, Tim decided to enroll in a casual painting class, a diversion from the relentless stress of his day job. There was no grand plan, no profound expectation. It was merely an attempt to ease the pressure that had been building up inside him. From the moment the brush met the canvas, a spark ignited within Tim. The colors swirled and danced under his touch, forming shapes and structures that mirrored the depths of his imagination. He was no longer just Tim, the accountant. He was Tim, the artist. The canvas became his ledger, the palette his spreadsheet, and the brush his calculator. He was crunching colors instead of numbers. And for the first time in a long while, he felt alive. He felt content. As weeks turned into months, Tim found himself more and more engrossed in his newfound passion. He started spending his weekends painting, his living room slowly transforming into an art studio. His artworks, once just playful experiments, started gaining recognition. People were drawn to his unique style, his ability to convey raw emotions through vibrant strokes of paint. Tim's transformation was not just about finding a new hobby or a stress buster, it was a journey of self-discovery, a journey that led him to his hidden talent, his true calling. The satisfaction he derived from painting was unlike anything he'd experienced before. It filled the void, the echo within him quieting down to a peaceful hum. Tim's story illustrates that talents can lie dormant waiting to be discovered. Just like a seed waiting for the right conditions to sprout, our hidden talents may just need the right environment, the right moment to reveal themselves. And when they do, they can transform our lives in the most unexpected and beautiful ways. So how does one go about uncovering their hidden talents? Well, the path to discovery begins with a single step, and that step is curiosity. You see, the world is a vast buffet of experiences, each with its own unique flavor. Don't be afraid to sample these experiences to try new activities that catch your eye. This is the first practical step to discovering your talents. Play an instrument, try your hand at painting, or maybe even take up a sport. The key is to explore, to venture into the unknown. Now, as you embark on this journey, it's important to keep your ears open. Listen to feedback from others. Often, people around you can spot your strengths and talents before you're able to see them yourself. They offer a fresh perspective a different lens through which to view your abilities. So, don't shy away from constructive criticism, embrace it as a tool for growth. But remember, the most important voice to listen to is your own. Self-reflection is crucial. Ask yourself, what activities make me feel alive? Where do I find my flow? These answers often hold the key to your hidden talents. Finally, understand that stepping out of your comfort zone is essential. It's in these unfamiliar territories that we find ourselves that we truly discover what we're capable of. Remember, talents are not just inborn, they can be cultivated. So, go forth and cultivate yours. Discovering your talents is the beginning, not the end. The road to self-improvement doesn't stop at the point of realization. No, my friends, it's merely the starting line of a journey that extends far beyond. It's one thing to uncover your gifts, but another entirely to nurture and develop them. It's akin to finding a seed. The seed in itself has potential, but it's the nurturing, the watering, the time and effort invested that transforms that seed into a blooming flower. Your talents too are seeds waiting to bloom. It's not just about discovery. It's about growth. It's about pushing boundaries, stepping out of comfort zones and continuously improving. It's about investing time effort and yes even enduring failure in the pursuit of becoming a master of your craft this journey may not be easy but it's rewarding and remember when you know what you're good at and work on it you're on your way to becoming the best version of yourself